These are my hammock straps. They work awesome. I love them. They're great. And they're better than what you're using. They're better than yours, plain and simple. Did the title of this video trigger you? Well, I guarantee it might not have triggered you, but anytime you put up a video about anything hammock related, it triggers people. It absolutely triggers them. That ain't the way I do it. That ain't the way so and so does it. Man, you're an idiot. Man, F you, man. I hate you. Your mother is Satan. That's usually not you guys. Not you guys. But I guarantee, look back a few months in this video, and I'll be called every name in the book. Got to move the camera. And that's just how simple it is. Did that trigger you? <laughs> Crap. Okay, let's let's do this. <sighs> These are better than yours. If you don't like it, why don't you freaking meet me somewhere? <laughs> and I'll prove it. And then, man, if you want to go, we'll go. So what I am using, I'm using some heavy-duty cordage. This is super strong stuff that I get from a company called Lawson equipment this is either three millimeter or five millimeter I can't really remember however I'll put a link to Lawson the entire geniusry around this is the cam jam made by night eyes so I've got my carabiner that came with the Clark jungle hammock I simply do this let me see if I can show you here. Keep everything in focus. I've tied a loop knot. That loop knot goes into the carabiner. Now I hook the cam jam. And now everything is controlled right here. You simply loosen or tighten the cam jam to set your hammock at whatever height you desire. No knots, very simple, super fast, very lightweight. And we're going to take, um, we're going to weigh this thing also just to make sure so you can see exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, all right, all right, what about this? My hammock straps are way better than yours. As a matter of fact, if you don't use what I use, you wear small jock straps. Okay, once more quickly. I've got my hammock laid out on the ground, and this is it. This is this is all I'm dealing with. I've got the loop knot right here. It's all tied in there, and I've got the cam jam. Doesn't matter which one. I'm going to just clip one of these, one of the other, into the existing carabiner on the hammock. Done.
this thing ain't going nowhere i'm uh, around 200 pounds maybe a little bit less that cord will hold me and a lot heavier people okay so there's no worries about that cord okay let's weigh them now keep in mind the more cordage you add the heavier it's going to weigh so you can uh, add weight to it or take away this just happens to be my setup got it set on ounces all right that one right there has the most cordage on it that's 3.2 sad the second strap all right so the total weight on those straps 5.6 ounces i love these cam jams i think they're a great invention right here you can see that the cord it'll hold two millimeter to five millimeter these are the metal cam jams by the way and they have a max load of 280 pounds so multiply that two by two and that's 560 pounds so i think even these small ones will hold most of you guys out there okay y'all that is it i hope i didn't trigger you too bad and if i did well wipe your tears thanks for watching Thanks for participating as I shared my opinion on hammock straps. I'll see all of you again real soon. He ain't got no right to share his opinion on hammocks and hammock straps and stuff like that related to the outdoors. I'm going to get him. I'm going to get him. <laughs>